Welcome back. Well, we have string, sand, and sticks. <laughs> Different items that get kids off the computer and into their minds, really creating. Our friends from Whoops in Company join us today. Good morning to you, Missy morning. Stein. This Hi. is awesome. I so remember. Yeah, string art. I know, isn't it funny? Yes. And, you know, they they just brought it out in a book that it's you forget about those things to pass along and show the kids. You yes. know, like I remember doing it, and now you'll even see some of it on Pinterest and things. Oh yeah. So Klutz does an amazing job because they give you really really great ideas of things that you can do inside, mm -hmm. and all the tools to do it. But then it's string and it's you know pins, so you can turn around and buy more string and more pins and make more art. And even at this point, it's great gifts for the holidays. Oh yeah, you can I get kids keep them busy, you know? you know. Especially when they can't get outside, but right. you want them off the computer. Right. Right. Okay, let's go with sand because I even saw this at a, a higher end store. Yeah. At uh, the airport mm -hmm. at Chicago O'Hare. Absolutely. Yeah. So this is called. There's different variations, but kinetic sand, and it's 98% sand and 2% some magical formula that makes it mold and keep together. So ah. it's something that you can roll. It feels like sand. And we're getting a lot of people in that are saying their kids have some sensory things and so mm -hmm. they don't like things that stick to their hands. My, and this, my niece is like that. She's yep. very, I mean, she doesn't even like temporary tattoos. Yes. I mean, so she yep. doesn't like anything exactly. like that. Exactly. And so this is fun because it has the grit of a sand. So it feels like you're at the beach. You know, you feel like you're playing with wet yeah. sand, but it doesn't stick to you. And then the sister is bubber. And bubber is kind of fun. <laughs> One, it's fun to say. But two, it feels more airy. It oh, feels geez, like foam, but it keeps its shape and it comes in great colors. Okay, this is really wild. Yeah, so if some, that. you know, if some kids or people don't like the sand, yeah. you know, they don't like the grit, this doesn't have the grit. No, it's almost yeah. like a, I don't know, a less tacky, sticky, mm -hmm. silly putty. Yeah, and it's really light and airy, and it's funny because kids love it, and we put it in a tray and... Kids uh, nothing. Yeah, <laughs> well, know? and we have... Adults getting it and making little sandboxes on their desk, you they, know, like yeah. just something to kind of futz with. That's right, yeah. especially if you're nervous or anxious yep. about something. Absolutely. Okay, now this next one I think is really cool for like a place setting, uh, party favors. Mm -hmm. I just think this is really cool. And this is a real spin off something we use when yeah. we were kids. Yeah. So I remember taking a piece of paper and coloring with crayon, just coloring the entire page, right. and then painting it with like black tempera paint and having to wait for it to dry oh, before yeah. you can do anything. Well, now they took that part of the work, but That's you still cool. get the fun, creative part of it. And it's kind of fun because it comes in the small ones, reminds me of like post-it notes. You could write a little letter, yeah. drop it in an envelope, up to big kits where you can make art and you, or sketch pads and kind of do a fun, bright <laughs> twist on it. Mm -hmm. I love it. Where is Whoops and Company located, Missy? We, we're in Sequoia Commons on the corner of Midvale and Tokay. Mm -hmm. Love it. Your ideas are so awesome. Every time Thanks. you're here, oh, this is just terrific. This was better than the last. <laughs> They're good. all good. Good. Thank you. Thank you. And we'll be right back. Pretty cool stuff. Isn't that 